much love and today i have a what's in my travel bag edition this is my bag and i just got back from a trip i went to budapest and it was so exciting and i will show you what's in my travel bag this bag is from toad stories i will mention it down below and i got it custom made with my initials which i really love and you can choose the font size the color and also choose the model i got the bag with the longer handles because i wanted to use it all year around so i could also wear it when i'm wearing a winter coat but this is my bag and i'm so excited to show you what's in here i got quite a lot of things so let's start right away make sure to check out my blog and to subscribe and i will show you what's in my bag the first thing that is in my bag in my travel bag is my little shoulder bag i just got the most important things in here like id phone wallet keys so and that's in here so just my wallet my boarding pass my um, what else i got i got a band-aid i got some um toothpicks really important i got my wallet this is my hermes wallet i love it so so much i also got a charger so that was in here first uh, and what i really like about my travel bag it has a little clip so the bag is so heavy it has a little clip so i attach my shoulder bag to it and nobody can go away with it so i really like that as well then the next thing i got in here i really love i got this from my aunt we went together to budapest and we got a little souvenir so it is this little magnet and i really love it is the saint matthias kerk with stars and the moon and i really love the stars i saw it right away and i was so in love with it so i'm really happy with this so that's the the second thing in my bag then i got a book it's by an hungarian author i really like reading and i wanted to immerse myself more in culture so i got this book it's by antal zerb and it's called journey by moonlight and i love this color i was really on the lookout to get this edition because they just released it and i really love the pink cover how gorgeous is that and i really like it so far um on page 80 exactly and i love the book it's really interesting so i'm excited to read some more of this then i got a water bottle because we need to stay hydrated and i love some fresh water so that's the water bottle then we went to a place called ruina bistro and it's called mazeltov i will put it here on the screen for you and i loved it so much so we went there two times to to have dinner and we had lunch one time and i fell in love with the place it looked amazing i fell in love with the food it was so incredibly tasteful and i just loved the whole vibe and the second day we saw they had a cookbook but we just forgot about it and then the last day before we went on a plane we were like oh I wish we purchased the book. So then, from my aunt, I got this cookbook and I love it so much. I just cooked the falafel out of it and it tasted amazing. I love the blue. I'm sorry for the bubble. I really love the blue design, the cover, and inside it has this beautiful print. 
and i love it so much doesn't that look amazing i love it and so i just cooked this yesterday for my family and i thought it was amazing so i'm really happy with this book and i love my aunt so much that i got it then we just got some things left i got my sunglasses i really love this pair i mean how gorgeous are these i feel so fashionable with this also i will link down this pair i don't know if i can find it but i will link some similar pair if i can't find the link and i will also be linking the outfit i'm wearing right now and the beauty things i got some exciting things coming in the post as well so you will see that in a future video and the budapest vlog will also be a future video so stay tuned for that because it's really exciting i really was impressed with how beautiful budapest is okay next i got some liquids i always like to keep the liquids in bags like these and then i will put them together in a bigger bag so at first we got the ritual of ayurveda balancing body cream by rituals i love this scent i love all their products but this is one of my favorites so i got this and it's indian rose and sweet almond oil you will smell delicious especially if you pair it with this body lotion night we shower gel i got um, a big bag of little shower gels and it's so handy for when you're traveling so this is by molten brown london delicious rhubarb and rose this one and if you pair the two together you will smell so good i got so many compliments about it so that's the next thing then i of course got some lipstick this the fancy beauty in gloss bomb one universal lip luminizer i love this so much and I love the packaging, it makes me feel really fancy. Then I got a mini mascara, this is by Clarence, the Super Volume Mascara, it works wonders. So I love that as well. I got a little Dio to rent um, by Rituals as well. I love just all their products and it's the Ritual of Sakura Rice Milk and Cherry Blossom. It's a fragrance, so, so good, really refreshing. I got Clean Leak, almost black honey. I love this product. I got this from my sister and I'm so thankful I did. Then I got my favorite spring fragrance and it's by Jo Malone. I almost finished the bottle, so I might have to repurchase it. It's called Wild Bluebell and it smells delicious, like light floral. It smells exactly how I picture spring to smell like. So I love this bottle and you will love that too as well. And I got some little samples because I really like to try out new samples. So this is Gucci Bloom Intense and this is Libre, also the intense version. And I would highly recommend Libre Intense. I think I will purchase it because it smells amazing. Okay, so that's the first bag. And then I got a little makeup remover. It's just the Bioderma put in this little Kiehl's bottle. So I need to have little bottles. Then I got mouthwash because you cannot go anywhere without it. I really like this one. So that's another must have for me. Then I got, oh my, it's this bottle with shampoo. I just put the Kerastasis, the white and orange bottle in here because I like this bottle. And it was uh, my own bottle of the shampoo is way too big to travel with. And then I got hand sanitizer because that's another must have. I will always have this on me together with tissues because you need to be prepared wherever you go so that's the another bottle then i 
got this little booklet for Budapest just so we could read more about it and plan our trip more and i really love this i would recommend this though and i am almost finished then i have magnesium pills because i cannot travel without it i have to keep some on me because you never know then i got chewing gum this flavor also really handy to have on you i got a hair tie another must have then i got a power bank i cannot travel without a power bank so i got a power bank i got my earphones because i like to listen to music or a podcast i'm really into podcasts right now i will put my favorite down in the description because you need to listen to those i really love this i got a pair of tissues then i got this charger head i'm not sure how to call it and that's almost all then i got a tea bag because sometimes they can give you hot water but uh, then i don't like the tea flavor so this is always handy to have on me and then right in the front i got a pen also a must have so that was all i really love this bag it's so spacious and you can fit so 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 much in here i really liked it i will leave down um the exact measurements or font size and where i got everything from including the bag and the other products i hope you enjoy watching so this was all that was in my travel bag when i went to budapest the budapest vlog will be coming soon so stay tuned for that i hope you enjoyed watching thank you for your support i would love for you to subscribe and check out my blog and i see you in the next video love always from lynn